Hello, everybody. I just finished the Fit Star yoga workout. I decided to do that instead of the personal trainer workout because my body's been so sore for the last couple days. I thought maybe I needed to stretch my muscles. And then after I take a rest, I'm riding the exercise bike. What are you doing? Sitting here. Yeah? Yeah. Well, you asked me what I'm doing. <laughs> and yes, we know it's inauguration day. And we're not really political people. But we're watching all the rioting go down. We knew that would happen. But I don't think these vlogs should be full of politics and all that kind of garbage, so... We don't throw it up all over the place. But then after I ride the bike and take a shower, it's back to work again. But one good thing is that I have Christine there until 11.15 tonight. Only a, a half an hour shorter than I'm there. So together we'll get everything done. So that'll be cool. Hey everybody, how you doing? Uh, today I've been out, fed and watered the animals. Went out and checked the mail. And clean ashes out of some more ashes out of the wood stove. Cut up firewood. Brought in firewood. Got dinner started right now. Um, I'm having ribs and we're gonna have chicken tonight. And I haven't figured out what else we're gonna have with side dishes. Probably some type of potato and whatever else. Not sure yet. But this is the wood pile right now. I'm figuring there's like anywhere between six to seven days worth of wood there. Um, other than that, it's nice and full, looking good, so, um, tomorrow I'll probably cut up a little bit more wood, just to re-top off the wood box again, just that way it's topped off, and I've been watching Armageddon on TV, well, the Netflix anyway, don't have much to say besides, I got sawdust all over the floor again, which, that'll get cleaned up probably tomorrow, and, other than that, I'm going to get some potatoes dug out, Mm. We're out what, what else we're gonna have long dinner? I'm not sure yet. We don't have a whole lot, a whole lot of vegetables, which I said that yesterday. Well, we've got even less today. Uh, we'll probably have a rice aroni of some sort or something like that tonight, and probably not have any vegetables to save the vegetables for another day. And I'm not sure if I want to do mashed potatoes or want to just bake them or what have you or do maybe a fried potato with onions, I don't know. I might just do a baked potatoes. But I'm going to sit down and watch some more Armageddon for the meantime. Well everybody, I got dinner made. Tino's still not home from work yet, but she'll be home in the near future. And this is just what I got for my dinner, baked potato. I ended up making uh, rice a roni, red, bean, and red beans and rice, and ribs, and a dinner roll. And the only thing that's different on Tino's plate is that she's got chicken, so other than that, that's what we're having. Um, not a bad dinner, I don't think. So right now, I'm watching Netflix and waiting on Tino to get home. I've already done washed all the dishes from dinner. The only thing that's left is our plates and silverware and that's it. Otherwise the dishes are all washed. So she'll be glad to see that when she gets home. Good morning everybody. We decided to make this a two day one because I came home absolutely exhausted. I ate dinner and went to bed. I worked till 11.45 and then had to take Christine home so I was just tired. Good morning. Good night. <laughs> You just woke up, so you're tired. Oh, yeah? Yeah. I didn't just wake up. We've been up for a little bit now. Ten minutes? Fifteen, maybe? Uh, long enough to smoke a cancer stick and wait for the coffee for next to brewing. Huh. And I'm making my usual breakfast. This one is not a farm egg, so it's not as good as the farm eggs. Not as big, but that's okay. The chickens are not laying eggs right now for some reason, so... They're going to be two years old in April, so we think they might be done. We're not sure. We're already They're talking about getting old. new chicks in the uh, in the spring. Somewhere between two to three years old is when you start noticing the decrease in the age. Yeah. Doggy! 
We have the doors open because it was very hot in here when we woke up, so he needs to stay like that or he'll run away. You always run away. Why do you run away? <laughs> yep, he'll take off, probably take off on to the other side of the river. Yeah, swimming around. Well, now he can't swim. He, uh, he's, it's iced, but I don't want him out on the ice. He could fall through because it's been warm all week. Yeah, it should be thick enough. Especially for him, he'd probably could get away with a dent and all, maybe an inch, inch and a half, he could get away with. Yeah. You only need two inches of ice for it to be safe to walk on, two to three inches. Huh. <coughs> Seems like it should be more. Well, you got to have more than that if you're going to take the snow machine or something out on it. Two to three inches for it to be safe to walk on. Oh. And then, of course, I'm going to do the workout and ride the bike and take a shower and go to work. That's how my days go on the weekends. Why are you laying there, Sammy? You know you can come through the door, right? Usually that's where you lay when you're begging to come in. But obviously the door's open, so what are you doing? <laughs> Sammy, look. Sammy. Hey. Hey. <laughs> Don is sharpening his chainsaw. Second time of the year so far. Yeah, and how long does it take? Close to a half hour with this saw. Uh, yeah. Because of so many teeth. That would be boring. So I'm all ready to go to work. I have less than 10 minutes, then I have to leave. Christine will be there again, but only till 9. But we can still get things done. And there's Tog. He's like, what are you doing? <laughs> Sammy just walked by. Oh, there he is. You're going to hide out behind me? <laughs> and then... I know we're having chicken legs because he's got him here to thaw out for dinner. But that's all I know about it so far. But we'll get it figured out. And off to work I go. Well everybody, well, it's been a pretty good pretty good day today. As you guys already know, Tino already done left for work. Um, I just about got dinner done right now. I got potatoes in the microwave going right now. So I'm having baked potatoes, raceroni, and the raceroni is uh, chicken and broccoli and might have some kind of bread or something like that and I had swept the floor shook the rugs out I still haven't vacuumed yet and that's something else that you know want me to do is get the, get the floor just uh, swept and vacuumed but so far I just got the floor vacuumed or swept and that's it still got the vacuuming left to do I already got the vacuum out to do that got wood in when I cut up wood earlier today and that's what I got going on right now for the wood, all the way up to the ceiling. There's easily a half cord or just over, probably just over a half cord. And then there's a little pile of wood there that I brought in. Um, there's like maybe a couple bits and pieces left of wood out there yet. And there's two pieces out there that I have to take an axe to and make it a little bit smaller for it to get into the door of the wood stove. Um, now other than that, I'm going to go ahead and get the floor vacuumed here in the next few minutes. I'm going to go and smoke a cigarette, and then I'll, pro then I'll worry about that. But right now i got big chunks of uh, wood chips to pick up, so that way I'm not trying to pick it up with the vacuum and plugging it up or anything like that, so that way I don't hurt the vacuum. Um, other than that, when I get those two pieces of wood split and brought in, I'm not going to worry about cutting up wood. I'm going to say there's easily a week's worth of wood in the, in the house right now and it did rain a little bit ago, come down pretty good, didn't last long, but they did say we were supposed to get rain today and well, we didn't get very much, but hey, whatever. I kind of wish it would have just absolutely downpoured and melted off all the snow, but hey, whatever. And I've been watching Norbit that just on uh, the PS3, and that just got over a few minutes ago. But for the meantime, I'll let you guys go and talk at you later. 
Well, everybody, I got the floors all vacuumed and swept and everything that Tino wanted. That's all done. And d dinner just literally got done. Tino's not home from work. She'll be home from work probably, I don't know, probably anywhere between quarter after midnight, 12.30, anywhere around that time frame. Um, other than that, I'm going to go ahead and fix my plate and Tino's plate so that way it's all fixed and done and over with. And find something to watch on TV and sit down and relax and enjoy the thought that I don't have to worry about wood for a, like a good solid week about not having to cut it or bring it in. I may or may not cut wood tomorrow, I don't know, but if I don't I'm not going to worry about it. Like I said, i got a good solid week worth of wood in the house now. But, <clears throat> other than that, we're not a word just to talk right now. Okay, well, I ended up deciding to wash the dishes before I sit down and eat. But I got my plate of food all fixed up. Tina's old plate of food all fixed up. Her, I just put her plate in the fridge. And I looked through the DVDs and found a movie to watch that I want to watch. I'm going to watch uh, Castaway. And right now I am curing the cast iron frying pans, so that way they'll be cured before I sit and eat. And other than that, um, pretty much all the housework is done. Dishes washed, except for the dishes that we're using to eat with. And I did not drain the dish water because of that. I figured, well, I'll eat and then I'll wash my plate and stuff, and then I'll uh, just go ahead and drain the dish water out because then the only thing that's going to be left is Tennille's plate and her silverware and that's going to be it. <clears throat> but other than that it's been a successful day on getting some chores done. I didn't do a whole lot today but did get some things done around the house that Tennille wanted done. The wood thing was my idea. But other than that it's been a relaxing day besides the few chores I did around here and feeding the animals crap like that. Well, I'm home, and while I was at work, I bought an SD card from somebody on Facebook. She posted it, and it is exactly the kind I need. And, uh, so I messaged her, and I told her to meet me at work, and that I would buy it from her. So, I think it's in the shadows, but that's exactly the kind I need. And I got it for $11. She originally wanted $15. Somebody else messaged and said they'd give her $10, but then didn't reply. So I messaged and I said, if you can meet me at the Indian River X-Way, I'll give you $11. See what I did there? <laughs> no. <I'm> blank. <laughs> so it's cheaper than the $15 plus gas money to go to Sheboygan and get one from Walmart. And I had to get cash back so to pay her, so I got him another caramel. And then I got him this, and then he told me, I texted him and asked, he said he likes the white frosting ones too, so, there. That's pretty rare and cream, but... Yeah. Well, they had this one sitting there too, so I thought, well, maybe you'd want that too. Gigantic. Every time they're there, I get them for you. Oh, yeah? Yeah. So, here you go. So how was your night? It was a night. Yeah. So I'm going to eat and then finish editing this and get it exported and uploading and then we'll go to bed. One more day of work and then it's over with. So we're going to say good night and we hope you enjoyed the video and that you like, subscribe, comment, share and you're having a good night. Good morning. <laughs> oh sure. No dessert time. Good night Tug. Good night Sammy. Good night rats on the other side of the wood. We'll see you tomorrow.